with Charlie here. He's a 10, 11, 12 week old puppy. I think he's 11 weeks on feeding. So he actually showed a tiny bit of resource guarding when I was feeding him. When he took a bone, good boy, wait. Oh, that was my fault. So what you want to do with resource guarding is you want to actually add things to it. You don't want to just take it away and pull it apart. That's like the worst thing you want to do. It's like you're eating a sandwich and I just snatch it to see if I can. You do not want to do that with dogs. You also don't want to put your hand in their bowls. It's a great way to get bit. Sit. Charlie! Wait. Okay, so when I put the food bowl down, what I want to do is as I look up, I throw food in. So I want him to realize that when people approach, doesn't matter if it goes in the bowl, great things come inside. So I walk up, side the bowl. I throw. So now he's going to anticipate people that it's a good thing when they walk up instead of tensing up because you're going to take the ball away. Do not put your hands in the food bowl. Do not take it away from your dog. That's a great way to create resource guarding. If you're starting to see little things at a young age, contact a professional because we can definitely help that at an early age. You don't want to wait until they're older and make it a really bad habit.